Hey guys, I'm um, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Block Tech Tips. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to change the um, fan in the cases where or I'm going to show you how to fix an issue where your laptop is giving a warning on boot that its um, internal fan is failing. And of course, one of the um, symptoms of this issue is that um, your laptop will suddenly shut off when you're using it at random. And that's because um, the fan is either underperforming or it's, of course, dead. As a result of it's not pushing enough air to cool your um, cool your laptop as you can see here um, in order to fix this you need to switch out this fan um, you can find a replacement part online I'll put a link below in the description where you can actually find the um, fan this is a HP I have a separate disassembly video I'll also link that below how to get to this stage where you actually disassemble but I'm just explaining what I'm gonna or what you need to do in the case that the fan is failing you'll need to switch out this fan uh, you can find these online or if you have a um, matching laptop you can actually um, get the fan from that um, in this particular case i think i have a matching fan so what i'm going to do is I'm going to switch this out um, let me show you the matching fan this is the matching fan in a separate laptop that i have this one is not functioning um, what i'm going to do is going to replace this one with this one up here they look close enough let's hope it will fit and in that case we're hoping that it will uh, fix the issue um, straight away it's very easy to remove the fan you're gonna get your um, screwdriver and of course you're gonna remove these screws in this case there's a screw over here and there's a screw over here um, once you remove both screws I've removed them already you're gonna um, detach the fan from the motherboard so you can look out for the fan header which is this header here you're gonna remove and of course you're gonna switch in the new fan and of course I'm gonna do this right now as I said, we have the disassembly video separately for this, not to make this video too long. We have loosened the um, fan. I'm going to um, remove the fan. The cable, to simply follow the cable. You're going to find the jumpers, which is for this section over here. It's very easy to remove. I'm going to um, pick. Simply to remove. Notice it slides out. Let me just get this out. Um, you can also um, find the lead, which is the cable, and you can um, tug on it to also um, remove it as well. All right, so I've used the um, something like a flat tip screwdriver and carefully I've um, plucked it out. And then you can remove the fan. It might be stuck under something, so you'd have to move this aside. You're going to get it all the way out, and that should remove the fan. All right, guys, so the fan um, easily came out. So this is the problem part. Um, this HP here um, this is the part number serial information as you can see here this is the internals for the fan and of course you can see here all right so this is very simple to switch out um, in terms of replacing the fan for the HP laptop all right so we're gonna switch out to this one right over here Alright guys, so with the um, matching new replacement CPU fan, you're going to put this into um, place. Slide it, sorry. You're going to um, slide this into place. It should fit right in. Um, you're going to make sure it's seated properly. And of course the lead is going to go in here. You're going to screw in back the screws. And of course it should be easy to um, do, so I'm going to make sure this is aligned. Alright, so I'm going to screw these in, you can put in the new fan, you're going to screw this all the way in, it should hold firmly, stop screwing as soon as you hit the um, unit resistance, you don't have to over tighten, again over here, you're going to do the same thing. Alright, and of course we're going to reconnect this header right here to the um, board. Um, if you're going to look um, seek a replacement fan, it must be an exact match. It cannot be a, um, another um, from another device. It has to be exact to HP. All devices use different type of connectors. They also are different size, so they won't fit necessarily. So what you got to do, guys, is you got to make sure 
All right, guys, so just make sure that you um, screw those in. Next, make sure the connector is uh, reconnected to the board. Should be quite easy. It clips into um, place. Simply um, slide it in. You're going to set it right here. Forgive me again. It's very difficult doing this while um, recording this video. It will slide right in. Notice it goes right in. All right, um, you're going to check your work. Make sure everything is um, okay. And then you're going to fit the back on the laptop once again. Um, once satisfied, um, you can um, close up. Uh, if you want to make sure that everything is working, you can try pouring this up. You can actually lift and I can um, test this out. All right, so I've um, adjusted the laptop to an angle. If you're very careful, do not turn, touch anything while this is on. We can still control this in the type of HP it is. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit power. Um, sometimes you need um, to make sure that it's plugged in. So let me plug this back in. All right, so I've connected the um, adapter. Getting power to the side here. I'm going to try to power up. There you go. New fan is uh, working. Notice it's posting. Do not touch anything on this side. Simply make sure the fan is um, spinning. Notice it's spinning right now. And um, once you do all of that, it should be good. Everything is up and running. Fan is spinning. And of course, this laptop is booting up. We are good to go. Now we can um, shut down and um, reassemble. Alright, so I'm going to reassemble now. The back is back on. We're going to um, place the screws in. Alright guys, so we have um, fully reassembled. As you can see, everything is up. The fan is in place and the laptop is good to go once more. Alright, so Ricardo Garden from Tech Tips saying bye until next time. Bye. Bye.